When I was a kid back in the 80s, the AIDS epidemic hit. And I was really blown away that you could have this epidemic called AIDS. And at the time, no one knew what caused it. And I couldn't believe with all our technology that we could not take a patient who was sick and understand what the causal agent was. That hit me really hard. And so I knew that at some point, what I would be doing is developing tools and technologies and going after mystery diseases and uncovering what's really causing them. The Chan Zuckerberg Biohub is a medical research organization, and the purpose of the Biohub is to develop the tools and technologies to understand the fundamentals underlying disease with an eye toward therapeutic and diagnostic development. The hub is built on collaboration. We want people to come together across these traditionally different kinds of institutions and boundaries to work together in ways they wouldn't have worked together before. It's really important that scientists in our organization know what everybody else is doing so that there's elimination of needless duplication, errors, inaccuracy, and also creating synergies where there were none before. We use Slack in a variety of different ways. One of the ways we use it is during our rapid response efforts in infectious disease. When we have something locally that maybe we need to respond to, like uh, a drug-resistant bacteria outbreak in a local clinic, we can actually initiate that event within Slack, create a new channel for it, join people who need to be on that team to work on it, and then that channel becomes a chronological record of all the different pieces of data that were obtained during that response effort and it really becomes an essential tool for being able to deconstruct how we did during a response event, and it makes us just better as a team. Our tools and technologies are the ones that enable lives to be saved, enabled epidemics to be averted. That's our goal.